Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today. It's the Weather Extreme Video, the morning edition. This is for Thursday, the 2nd of July. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather will be humid today. Scattered showers and storms around, probably not as many as recent days. Here's the upper air look this morning. Still got the main westerlies up north, kind of a typical summertime look. A troughing in the northwest, kind of a trough coming down the Atlantic coast. Uh, moisture a little less evident across the region today. But still, we'll have storms around, no doubt about that. That was the radar this morning. Things are quiet compared to yesterday. That was the composite at 452. Temperatures upper 60s and low 70s. Highs, I'd say 87 to 90 for most locations today. To the west, we have heat advisories. Arkansas, parts of Louisiana, Texas, Oklahoma, and some of the adjacent states. Here's the severe weather risk for today. Marginal risks well up in the northeast and in a broad zone from the High Plains down into parts of the Deep South, including the southwestern corner of the state, roughly from York down to Mobile and Dauphin Island. That's where the heavier storms are expected to be. Tomorrow, the standard uh, slight risk way up north, and on day three, which is Saturday, a marginal risk again for the northern states. We're in the green. That means scattered storms about, but organized severe weather not expected. Here's the rain for the next seven days. The western third of the country dry. Around here, heavier totals over the southern counties of the state, if this verifies. This is through Thursday morning of next week. For North Alabama, rain amounts one-half to one inch. Down to the south, one to one and a half inches for South Alabama. And remember, these maps are tough to draw in summer because of the tremendous variability in the placement of showers and storms every day. And still, no tropical mischief anytime soon. Things look nice and quiet. So, model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS. The 06 Sea Run, 4 o'clock today, troughing up and down the Atlantic coast, upper low in the northwest, upper high, parked over Oklahoma and Kansas. And you can see that uh, the GFS trying to tell us that the moisture will not be as deep today. So showers and storms more widely scattered today, partly sunny with highs 87 to 90. And really the same thing tomorrow. We could see low 90s in many spots. Could be a pretty hot day if this verifies, with showers being uh, relatively widely spaced. Holiday weekend. This is Saturday. Again, high up around 90. Showers possible. They'll be fairly widely scattered if this is correct. Again, the mo models have clearly backed off a bit on the moisture content. This is the precipitable water Saturday. You know, yesterday we had those dark orange shades well up into the state. Well, now... Uh, precipitable water values mostly in the oh one and a half inch range, not the two inch range. So bottom line is typical summer weather on Saturday, partly sunny, hot, humid, a pop up storm possible. This is Sunday, pretty much the same thing. Moisture may be a tad deeper Then for next week. This is Monday. And again, we'll just roll with a persistence forecast, partially sunny with scattered, mostly afternoon and evening storms Tuesday and Wednesday, and a week from today, Thursday the 9th, upper high, 594 high back over the southwest. Uh, around here, heights about where they should be in a pretty standard summer day. Sun at times, a few scattered storms around. Let's go out 10 days. This is Saturday the 11th. Old nasty 597 high back in the southwest. That's where the hot weather will be around here. It'll be, you know, warm and humid. Scattered storms, nothing out of the ordinary. Rain from Birmingham off the European Ensemble, the mean between one and a half and two inches. And again, the numbers have come down on the most recent runs. Highs from the NBM, upper 80s and low 90s for a while. And the CPC outlook, July 9th through the 15th, showing temperatures maybe a little above average around here. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 4 o'clock this afternoon. You can catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless.
KS Heating and Air, the team ensuring your comfort.